boxers or briefs? Uh, I, 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 I can't do the Speedos, baby. That ain't me for me. That, I ain't about that life. The long-held debate about that life has always come down to preference until now. Researchers at Harvard say they have cold, hard facts to settle the score once and for all. And like Tamar Braxton, they say the Speedo gotta go. Harvard School of Public Health says the findings of its 17-year study published this week confirm beliefs that men who wear tidy whities tend to be less fertile than their freedom friends. Dr. Daniel Scora, who specializes in reproductive medicine, says the study is right on the money and that he's been doing his part to save Dallas's sperm count one patient at a time. Uh, I told patients who had minor changes in their sperm counts that they could try to wear boxers instead of briefs. But it's not just your underwear that could be your enemy under there. We always counsel our patients not to have prolonged exposures to hot tubs and things like that because we, primarily it's temperature that we believe changes the sperm count. That's right. When the temperature down there increases, doctors say sperm count decreases. Maroon 5's sizzling hot frontman Adam Levine further stirred up the debate earlier this year with his latest music video showing his clear preference for boxer briefs. Now, wait a minute. Where does that fit into the debate? <sighs> I guess we'll just have to wait for the next set of research papers from someone with a lot of time on their hands.